Comics Plus, what's going on, Akasan? Uh, everybody wanted me to watch this thing. Jeremy talks passion for giving back. Okay. Everybody, people are saying it looks like a vault commercial from the boys. Uh, crappy camera or not so great camera, web camera, because we're playing Resident Evil in a little bit. Let's go. This isn't it. Oh, uh, that's right. Remember when he was like a singer? But hey, man, imagine, uh, man, anytime I see space like this, it looks so cool. Like, I'm like, imagine what I could do with all this space, man. I just want to rent out something like that one day. I don't know if I'd be playing a piano or like Jeremy here, but yeah. All right, let's see. Here's the one. Oh, this is from ABC News. Okay. <laughs> Wait, is this for reals? And why is the volume so low? That's not me, folks. That's not me. I can barely... Where is this coming from? This is from ABC News. Okay. This is like a legit a channel with 14.2 million subscribers. The volume is hella low, dude. Okay. I just perfectly see him in a pool of blood coming from his head. When I ran up to him, you know, I didn't think he was alive. I'd do it again. You'd do it again? Yeah, I'd do it again. Because it's going right at my nephew. You have a video which is haunting. It's January 1st at 8.42. Yeah. You are 13 minutes away. Someone's been run over by a snowcat. Hurry. He's getting crushed. There's a lot of blood over here. He is in rough shape. Oh, Keep breathing, man. Keep fighting. Oh, Hang in there, brother. Oh, oh. This was the sound of someone that was dying. Seven tons of machinery bearing down, and one man's iron will to fight. <laughs> this is this this isn't real. This has to be. I mean. It's a terrible thing that happened to this dude, but I'm just like, somebody in the editing, like a producer didn't sit back and be like, damn, this looks like a parody or something, dude. What the hell? And this is, this is, this isn't even halfway over folks. Like this is like, I, I don't understand. There's still a good two minutes left of this. Arr. What? And survive. Eight ribs broken in 14 places. Yeah. Right knee, right ankle broken, left leg tibia broken, the left ankle broken, right clavicle broken, right shoulder broken, face eye socket, the jaw, the mandible broken, lung collapsed, mm -hmm. pierced from the rib bone, your liver, mm -hmm. which sounds terrifying. Yeah. And then like, what's my body look like? Am I just going to be like a spine in a... In a brain like a science experiment? His extraordinary fight to live and his family's heartache and pain. I think I know what it by is. By his side through it all. I heard that you had in sign language you said to your family, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I oh shit, we're all going to hell, y'all, laughing at this dude, but um um yeah, I think that's the problem. Disney just they just want to make money out of this whole thing. Like, I mean, I'm sure Jeremy's getting a good amount of a good cut from this, but it's 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 the narration that's what's doing it. His his will to survive outweighed everything else. It's like it's that kind of and then the slow paneling and oh my god. I mean, they showed us everything. Wait, is this this isn't even a trailer, huh? Yeah. Wait, what? What was the question? Yeah. By his side, through it all. 
I heard that you had, in sign language, you said to your family, I'm sorry. Jeremy, are you trying to make money off of this uh, personal tragedy of yours? Yeah. Yeah. There you have it, folks. There you have it. <laughs> secondhand entertainment. Yeah, secondhand embarrassment, right? Jeremy, is the house of mouse forcing you to make this interview so you can make some money during the pandemic? Yeah. Yeah, I thought so. I thought so. Thank you, Jeremy. A story of terror, survival. I chose to survive. You're not going to kill me. No way. And triumph. Jeremy Renner, Diane Sawyer. Do you dream of doing those stats again? Yeah. I've lost a lot of flesh and bone in this experience, but I've been refueled and refilled with love and titanium. The exclusive interview. You look in the mirror <laughs> and do you see the same face? No, I, I see a lucky man. Thursday, April 6th at 10, 9 central on ABC. Oh, man, they couldn't they couldn't make a Disney Plus out, special out of it. So they decided to make a uh, oh, it's literally a Diane Sawyer interview on Hulu and Disney Plus. Wow. Wow. Okay. Hi, everyone. George Stephanopoulos here. Thank you. I'm good. Thanks for checking. Oh, that's who George Stephanopoulos is. OK, cool. Yeah, the narrator, I mean, it's not even the narrator suck. It's just like somebody down the line should have been like, yo, let's not, like, it's 2023. Let's not goof it up as much. But, wow, I can see why everybody said it looked like a vault commercial. <laughs> <laughs> All right, y'all. Uh, let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Peace.